so hello everyone welcome back to mission view to youtube channel in this video we are dealing with the model question paper solutions of the vlsi embedded system a tech question draw the schematic structure and the graphical representation of the function y equal to a plus b bracket plus c into d whole bar using cmos logic also draw the layout for the same using the euler's path method in this video we have to draw the uh, schematic of the equation y equal to a plus b bracket plus c into d whole bar and the euler's uh, path method and the uh, layout there are totally three steps in this in this uh, question so first one is the schematic part that is solution schematic that is boolean equation y equal to a plus b to the bracket plus c into d whole bar so there are some rules for drawing the schematic that is for and operation that is and operation pmos is connected in parallel and nmos transistor is connected in series and for the or operation PMOS is connected in series and the NMOS is connected in parallel. So these are the rules for the drawing the schematic. Now uh, schematic part will be. So this is VDD. First in the pull up network which consisting of the PMOS transistor. First we have to draw for the A plus B equation. this is a this is b and next and the next one is they have given in between the plus so next one will be c dot d so the as the and operation is in between c and d these are connected in um, parallel this is c and this is d so this is the pull up network and next one is the pull down network which is the opposite of pull up network this is input a input b input c and this is transistor d so the pull down network is connected to ground part in between pull up network and pull down network there exists output that is y so this is the schematic of the equation y equal to a plus b bracket plus c into d whole bar so next we will draw the euler's graph euler's path so as there are many ways to draw the euler's path so i am taking uh, i am taking the path as a b c and d so the, this is for the pull up network and pull down network uh, same as the pull up network that is that is a b c and d so i am taking this part So we will draw the Euler's Euler's graph first, then the Euler's uh, then the layout part. So the Euler's graph is this is a we have to draw the same as the schematic part. This is this is a this is b. this is c and this is there is a node here and this is d so here arrow represents the euler's path and this is the euler's graph so this is for the pull up network 
and for the pull-down network same as the schematic this is A this is B and the C and the D here it is VDD and here exists the ground in between pull up and the pull down there will be a output output pi next to draw the layout first we need to draw the VSS and the ground so this is a metal contact which will be named as uh, VDD and it is ground so for metal we, are, we will draw uh, this is the representation of the metal and next we will draw the PD fusion For P diffusion, the representation is like this, and the next one is N diffusion. This is the representation of the N diffusion. So difference between the P diffusion and the N diffusion is the only the gap between these uh, cross crossed cross lines. So now we have to draw the. Uh, four transistor as there is there are four inputs this is one first transistor this is second one this is third and this is fourth So this makes the uh, tr uh, four transistors. We will name it as A transistor, B transistor, C transistor, and D. For before before drawing the layout, we have to first we have to draw the source and the drain. Represent the source and the drain. So for A transistor, this is the source and drain. Source drain. Source drain source drain and for the pull down network part this is drain source drain source drain source and drain and the source so as per the graph we have to label the label source and drain for each transistor so as our path is like this we have to start from the source that is source drain source drain and next will be source drain source drain next will be source drain and next is drain and the source for the drain and the source and for the pull down network that is uh, which consists of uh, most transistors we have to go like this way that is source and drain sorry the part should be like this that, that is a drain and source drain and source source and drain drain and source and the drain and the source So we have we labeled source and drain uh, for each transistor. Next one will be a connection part. So see here the source part of the transistor A is connected to VDD. That is source part of the transistor A is connected to VDD. We have to connect this. 
and this emergency uh, drain and source are automatically connected and here the source of C transistor and D transistor is connected to uh, drain of the B transistor that is uh, source of uh, C transistor is uh, directly connected to D so we have to connect only source of the D transistor to the B uh, drain of the B transistor next next one will be for the uh, pull down transistor pull down network so drain of drain of a transistor b transistor and c transistor is connected to the uh, drain of the uh, c transistor and d transistor that is drain of a transistor the, this one and the drain of B transistor and the drain of C transistor that is the same here B and the, uh, B and the C drain are connected each, each other so you have to connect these for the C and the D for the PMOS transistor C and the D and that is connected to the output part output Y and the source of A source of A transistors source of B transistor and the source of D transistor is connected to ground that is source of A transistor and the source of B transistor and the source of D transistor these are all connected to ground this is the contact parts so this is the layout part and the, this is schematic part and this is the Euler's path so the whatever uh, asked in the question we, we drawn all three questions so these are the solutions if you have any doubts regarding these questions uh, please comment in the comment section i will cl clarify your doubts so in the next video we will be explaining about the 8b part so please like the video and subscribe to mission video youtube channel and also share with your friends so stay tuned for the next videos Thanks for watching.